Hey, hey, whoops, snaps, this is Tortimer the Grey. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Pokemon Showdown Little Cup Battles. Uh, today, we are using the Priority Squirtle Squad. Um, I kind of just chose this one at random. Um, I actually got a challenge, which we'll see in the next battle uh, for one of our uh, longtime active uh, sub fighters. Uh, but I, I got a low cup challenge. I just kind of like, eh, sure, Priority Squirtle Squad. We went with that, and then I went and got another battle, but which we're seeing here, uh, which was uh, to fill out the episode. But uh, yeah, so uh, Kairos comes out. Bambi's gonna come in against the Barbroach. Take that Hydro Pump, no problem. Um, at which point Barbroach is gonna switch out, and Bagon's gonna be the one to take that Seed Bomb, which obviously resists, doesn't do barely anything. So uh, Bambi being Choice Scarf, Bambi's gonna come back out, and Simba is gonna take the Fire Blast. So that worked out pretty well, and pretty decent switch there. There. Uh, the Hyper Voice comes in, which is neutral damage on the Dragon, is going to finish off there. So Simba wrecking a little bit of house there against the Bagon. At which point Crusher is going to come in to take the Hydro Pump, having Dry Skin. Uh, and that's going to work out pretty well as well. Uh, the Fake Out lands, get us the Flinch. Uh, and so that works out until Crusher takes the Earthquake and she dies. So, But I mean, in the meantime, she did fine. Uh, unfortunately, uh, Bliff's going to switch into an Ice Beam, which is going to activate the Berry Juice at least. So not going to kill. Um, and Bliff lives to finish off the Barbaroach, so that works out pretty well. Uh, and then the Acrobatics are going to finish off that Bell Sprout there, and then Bidoof comes in, at which point we're going to throw up the Will-O-Wisp. It's going to miss. Bilip's going to take a hard Ice Beam. Uh, going to go for the Will-O-Wisp once again, trying to get that Bidoof a little bit neutered, uh, although it seems to be a special attacking Bidoof, but whatever, we'll take the progressive damage at the very least. Uh, Blip goes down, and Tip Tup's going to come in with the Fake Out there. Um, Bidoof obviously going to flinch, get a little bit of burn going at the Aqua Jet lands then, and finishes off uh, the final Pokemon from that shadow, and uh, Priority Squirtle Squad wins the day. So, uh, thank you so much. Well, I don't know why, who I'm thinking. This is a random person I battled on the ladder. I'm just used to doing that on Showdown, I guess. But anyway, let's check out the second battle here, shall we? Here we go. Alrighty guys, here we go with our second battle for today up against Nougat and Nougat, uh, we, I was, I think I was just waiting for, uh, uh, gray version battles and, uh, Nougat and I had battled previously and then a couple minutes later he sent me a little cup battle, I was like, ah, sure, why not? So we went to town and again, I just kind of like, he, I got the little cup channel, I was like, oh! sure let's go priority squirrel squad why not because they usually work out pretty well even though i mean they're obviously not a perfect team but i usually have fun using them and they usually work pretty well for me so um decided to bring them and uh, nougat gave us a good fight here crusher up against broom uh crusher taking a hard earthquake from broom we've seen broom quite a bit in the gray version uh tip tup switches in at that point forces out uh broom there um, and we are going to uh, fake out and aqua jet the Baneri into oblivion, so that works out pretty nicely. Uh, at which point Riolu comes in and Tip Tup's gonna go ahead and just stick in there. Um, throws up the aqua jet, gets that on Riolu's copycat, unfortunately. Um, and Kairos is gonna take a hard hit there, although the berry juice is gonna get him back up to snuff. Uh, and then he throws up the earthquake, which doesn't kill Riolu, but it does good damage to us. Um, and then Kalros is going to come back with that Iron Head to finish off uh, the Riolu. Is anybody else? I mean, I, I get that on Onyx is technically now like a, the first evolution, but it's still weird to me to see Onyx in Little Cup. I don't know. <laughs> it's just, you got like Torchic and Squirtle and then Onyx. That's just funny to me. But uh, Nougat's Torchic comes in and is going to overheat on Simba. Uh, Simba takes that reasonably well. Um, and then going to throw up the Hyper Voice here and finish off the Torchic, no problem. That Hyper Voice man really wrecks house. Um, throws up the Hyper Voice here as well, gonna finish off Broom, uh, and then Sharmu, uh, Nougat starter, is gonna come in here. Um, Hyper Voice is gonna do pretty good damage, um, but Simba's not gonna kill it, and it's gonna go down to the uh, uh, the Earthquake there, and then Bambi uh, is gonna come in and finish off uh, Sharmu there. So, uh, thank you so much for the battle, Nougat. I appreciate, uh, the random, uh, challenge in Little Cup there. Um, I don't always have time for that when I'm sitting waiting for Grey Version. A lot of times I'm working on another series or something. Um, if any of you have waited for a long time, sometimes, like, I've been recording other series during that time slot as well because it's like I, I can't sit here for a full hour What if nobody challenges me like that? I've got to do some other YouTube stuff So uh, so yeah, but I, I appreciate I had the time and so I had fun battling you gave me a reason to dust off the Squirtle squad The uh, priority Squirtle squad, so I appreciate that as well and you had a cool team cool team uh, and so uh, um, I, I enjoyed the battle, but anyway, uh, so yeah, that was uh, that was our little cup of ba battle for this week A couple of battles there for you guys. Thank you so much for watching I've been Tormund the Grey and you guys have been great Make sure those likes come in subscriptions for me, guys, and I'll see y'all back here next time. Alrighty, guys, have a good one.